The history of Korean Railway. For over a hundred years, it has been a journey of many challenges. And now, with the railway test track, we are preparing for a bigger takeoff. For a new chapter of Korean railway history. In the past, railway vehicles and supplies were tested, either on existing or newly constructed rail lines, which caused many restrictions. This emphasizes the need for an exclusive rail track, solely for the purpose of testing railway vehicles and supplies. Sleeper crack incident on Gyeongbu High Speed Railway 2009 and derailment at Gwangmyeong Station 2011. Continuous accidents on the railway demonstrate the importance of the systematic testing of vehicles and supplies and emphasize that test tracks are essential for the rail industry. The task force team for construction launched in 2009 and after the preliminary feasibility study in 2010, master plan and feasibility study started in 2012. As GS ENC Consortium becomes the contractor and designer, the construction of the railway test track began. Then what is the railway test track? It provides the same environment as the actual rail line and tests the performance of the vehicles and supplies in terms of applicability and reliability. Therefore, the track must be an independent facility for the tests, and it must be designed exclusively for the purpose of testing. The project area starts at Cheongjushi, Chungbu, and ends at Cheongdongmyeon, Sejongshi, and the construction period is 51 months. The target for completion is 2018. The total length of the project is 12.99 kilometers with 6,056 meters for earthwork, 1,517 meters for eight bridge units, 4,221 meters for six tunnel units, 1,196 meters for existing line. Roadbed and railway works architectural works such as integrated control center and system works such as electrical and signal works. The railway test track enables the testing of vehicles and supplies through 198 different tests in 447 types. The main tests for each test categories are retrogression, brake and maximum speed test of the vehicle, rail fastening system, track structure and turnout test of the track, structural and bridge, etc., structure-related tests, system electricity, tram lines, signals, and communication tests, as well as noise and air pressure tests. The main facilities for the tests are the station to check the electrical and stoppage status, and various ranges of curves and grades of the track to enable both low and high-speed train operation. The railway test track not only tests train vehicles, but also includes rail supplies and facility tests. The rail tracks are basically gravel tracks in order to facilitate the construction of the site. The track also includes concrete tracks for testing supplies such as sound absorption plates. For the high-speed switch development in the future, an installation area for testing is secured in advance. Structures such as an earth retaining structure and scaffold car structure are tested in the roadbed tests. 155 meter bridge test bed is exclusively for bridge testing. Alternation tests on various types of upper structures are possible by adjusting the span length of girder depth of prefabricated piers. Also, there is a substation test bed for AC and DC equipment, catenary test bed for various speed, switch point test, 
train stop system test, interlocking device and KRTCS test, ATC test, railroad crossing device test, and signal test bed with automatic block control unit. With an extruded wall, facing portal for tunnel hood test and basic facilities for soundproof walls. Here are the test items according to each segment of operation. This is the test line for AC segment. This is the maximum speed test for straight and flat level. This is the sharp curve test for AC segment. This is the steep grade test for AC segment. This is the test line for DC segment. This is the maximum speed test for straight and flat level. This is the sharp curve test for DC segment. This is the steep grade test for DC segment. Here are the supply and facility test items on the route map. The railway test track is designed with extension plans in mind. New 2.3 kilometer line from the end forms a small loop, enabling circular operation and securing test continuity. Combined with the large loop of the existing Gyeongbu line, railway test track can provide various test conditions and reduce operation testing time. Also, by expanding the straight section, high-speed band over 300 km per hour is secured, acquiring the aspects of the world's best test track. In order to stand alongside of countries with advanced rail systems and become the strongest country in the rail industry, the line must be expanded phase by phase in the future. Rail system is a large complex system of various technologies and each part plays an important role by collaborating closely between various parts. We have finally fulfilled our long cherished ambition. The railway test track will not only speed up the Korean rail industry but also contribute expansion to the overseas market. In addition, through industrial and research complexes with line extension, Jeondong Station will become the center of the rail mecca of Korea, greatly contributing to the economic growth of Korea. For the dream of Korea, for the future, for the world, we will do our best to run full speed ahead. Thank you.